Hi guys, what is up and welcome back to what is going to be a special day for the channel. Now, we are bringing back a series that was much loved on the channel in the very beginning, the early days, the dawn of time for my channel. Yes, I am talking about the Nuke vs. series. We are back with that bad boy. It has been requested for a long time now to bring that series back to the channel. It really kickstarted my channel uh, for me. This is way before I even did mob battles, which my channel is sort of known for now. Um, I feel like my channel is just known for battling and exploding things. Uh, that's, that's what we do here. So if you like that, you know, stick around, whatever. Um, but we are bringing it all back but it's going to be bigger and it is better because now we can do these nuke verses in 1.12.2 and above previously we were stuck in 1.7.10 um we were limited to mobs we were limited to the types of nukes we could use and yeah it just got very we were limited in and we pretty much done them all but now we have a whole new variety i am flipping excited for this guys i hope you are and we also have a return of for the long time viewers for the ogs on the channel the pit da -da -da -da. and it is bigger and it is better the whole place is now bedrock um <laughs> the whole area is bedrock and how we're going to structure this is we're going to do a little warm up with some of the nuclear weapons and then we're going to start nuking some of the massive mobs from the mods we choose um today i figured one of my favorite mods let's hit it lysonite's mod used to be nuked all the time on the 1.7.10 version and now i am super excited to be able to nuke these mobs on 1.12.2 with all the updated mobs it is going to be phenomenal guys i can't wait this is going to be back this series is back to stay for a fair bit of time so guys let your suggestions fly in i'm expecting to see a fair few suggestions in the comment section down below and uh, we will do the same thing as with mob battles where if you suggest it i'll put your name up on the board we'll give you a shout out and yeah we'll just chat about you uh yes yeah, so i'm flipping excited for this let's waste no further time but you know if you guys are new to the channel obviously make sure to subscribe hit that notification bell and smash that like button you know what to do all righty then oh it feels good to be back uh doing this little series i love it all right so we are going to be using one of the more powerful uh rocket launchers or nuclear rocket launcher things in the hb hbm uh nuke mod so that is the nuke mod that we are using um yeah so this is the one i've chosen out for today this is the rocket launcher we're using the ammo type is 84 millimeter rockets and uh they're pretty gosh damn powerful these are the ones we're using so the nuclear it's gonna be awesome all right so i have lined the mobs up here we're gonna be going through i'm gonna use the rocket launchers on all of them and then we're gonna like whatever survives will nuke so yeah let's do it so behemoth is up in here hello good sir now can you survive a nuke to the face can you bro oh Yes, he flipping can! Oh my goodness. Okay. Okay. Oh, he did not survive twice. Two times was the charm. Alrighty. Let's progress on to the cockatrice. Uh, oh no, what do I have next? Yeah, it is the cockatrice. Okay, hey bro. Can you survive a nuke? Yes, you can. Okay, I don't know how much health you have left. The cockatrice is legit on fire. Can you survive two of them? Dude, yes, the cockatrice is going like a flipping champ. Okay, let's see how many you can survive. Direct blasts. Okay, that wasn't... I wouldn't say that's a direct blast. That most certainly is. That definitely is. The cockatrice is mad good. Okay, come on. Release the final nook. Okay, come on. Come on. Hit me with them. Let's go, let's go, let's go. 
No, nope, they don't want to fire anymore. The cockatrice is like, nah, bro, I've somehow jammed your nuclear devices. Oh, oh, don't you worry. We have plenty more Well, that came from. We're just going to go down into here and we'll just grab out another rocket launcher. So, joke's on you, bro. Okay, here we go. Let's load this up. Boom. Okay, and let's get another one in here. The cockatrice was surviving those. So we know the cockatrice can survive that. We know the rest of these mobs can. So, you know what? I think we should just get straight on to straight up nuking them, to be perfectly honest with you. So, let's set up a nuke. So the nuke we are going to be using is going to be the SAR nuke. So here it is. And as soon as you spawn this kit in, uh, it throws like a hazmat suit on you and there's loads of different nukes as well um, I'm not 100% sure which is the most powerful in this mod now. It used to be uh, oh, It didn't used to be the SAR But it used used to be able to mix it up with stuff and make it super duper powerful But we're just doing a standard one as of now. I mean if it does flipping well, then you know we'll, we'll mix it up Okay, so let's load this bad boy up. Let's put all the bits and bobs in here. Uh, there you go, there you go. Nailed it. And we are also going to need some redstone to activate this stuff. Uh, where is the redstone? There we go. Get a lever out as well. Okay, and we'll get some of those. Nope, don't want to throw them. Uh, yep, give them back. Okay, let's take off the hazmat suit. I feel it's blurring my vision slightly. Okay, so it is all loaded up in here now. So we'll spawn in, uh, no, Gru, you are gonna die, bro. Okay, so we'll put this all the way over here and we'll put that there and let's get out the first few mobs. So let's get out a load of behemoths, baby behemoths, adorable. Okay, so we've got a load of behemoths up in here now and let's get out a cockatrice and yeah, we'll keep it at that for now, and then we'll do the next load in a bit. Okay, are you ready, Mr. Mobs? And, okay, the cockatrice is chilling. The cockatrice is dead. The cockatrice is dead. <laughs> nice. So this is the nuclear explosion, and leaves, like, toxic gas and radiation. That just wipes out flipping everything in a mile radius. That is some mad stuff. Looking sick. Nice. All right, so we'll wait for this to sort of like disperse and then we'll spawn in the next. Cause I, I don't know. Uh, will Rahovart survive the nuke? Honestly, I, I'm, ex I'm so excited to see. But I think he used to be able to. So we'll find out. I was going to say we will just nuke the Ingibus next, uh, or Ignibus, uh, I always pronounce it extremely wrong. But look what happens as soon as I place this mob down in this toxic gas. And I'll tell you what, we'll just turn the sound down ever so slightly because it is extremely loud. Just as it always sort of used to be. Okay, so watch this. Straight up death. You can't spawn these in and they survive. They are just wiped out so we know that guy won't survive the immediate blast so he's out he's he's gone for so these all get absolutely murked now we have the amalgalich up will the amalgalich survive in this smoke probably not but let's give it a go no it flipping doesn't it flipping doesn't look at this <laughs> That's amazing. No, straight up, straight death. The Amalgalich is so much health. This is how powerful this is, guys. Just look at look at this guy. Look at like even even the Russet ones, which have like double the health, just die. So I'll, I'll, I'm gonna put one on like the top of the roof or top of the wall. Oh no, there's some smoke up here as well. No. Uh, yeah, so I'm gonna like sort of sentence. I'm gonna push him in is, is what I'm gonna say uh, All right, let's, let's put let's put an amalgalich here. Nope dies up here as well. The, the smoke is all up here Okay, is, is the smoke outside? Let's go take a look. Let's will, will it? Yeah Yep, yeah, die dead dead. It's everywhere. It is absolutely everywhere so the amalgalich isn't surviving that but then 
He's not the most powerful. Let's do we do as modus now? Flipping look at that. It is ridiculous. Let's get in here and let's spawn in Asmodeus just to just to sort of see. No. No, he doesn't. That is madness. That is madness. Asmodeus can't even survive in this stuff. And that, that's a special Asmodeus. No, honestly, madness. Absolute madness. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to wait for this to disperse. And then we're going to spawn it in Rahovart. And it's going to it's gonna be go time, really. Will he survive? I don't think he will. I honestly don't. Okay, are we ready? The final battle, or the final nuke, rather. So we're going to put Asmodeus there. And we're going to put Rahovart there. Okay, and he's in, and they are all looking rather mean. Now, let's take a look at their health stats. So, can we even... So, 4,000 for Rahovart. And can I even see Asmodeus in the... No, no, can't... Okay, we almost briefly, really briefly saw it. Uh, but before they actually start fighting, and everybody starts dying, let's do this thing. Are we ready to watch the annihilation? Okay, get off, get off my screen. Okay, I'm ready. They've gone off. Have I? Have, have, did I leave it too too long? Did I? I I think I left the red red stone. I put the redstone too far. That's on me. That that's on me. That one. Uh, let's try it from here. Uh, let's try it from here. Okay. Goodbye, guys. Okay, so they're currently still standing. They are currently still here. Okay, I don't think the gas has reached them just yet, or it could well be lag. Now, we know uh, Asmodeus does die in the gas, but will Rahovart? So the gas is slowly spreading. Um, there, there you go. Asmodeus is gone. Rahovart is still... He's gone. He's gone. And that is that. That is that, guys. That is the very first... Nuke versus season two. Yeah, we're doing it by seasons because stuff it. We can do what we want. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys flipping enjoyed it. I did. It's great to be back. Make sure to hit that like button. Subscribe if you have not. Obviously, notification bell because you don't want to miss any more. And as always, guys, thank you so much for watching. Let the comments fly about what you want to see nuked. Until next time, see ya.